often we're walking just fine with Jesus until we look over our shoulder and see someone else. We're distracted by how they're walking or what they're saying or what they are doing. And as soon as we take our eyes off of Jesus to look at them, then we're tripping up. Our prayer life is hindered a bit. We get confused as to what we believe. And then we're stumbling around. Often Jesus has reminded me that I was walking just fine with him until I listened to an email or got a phone call or I listened a bit to what some other fella was saying. In those times, I remembered that before I listened to that person, I was doing just fine with Jesus, plugging along with him. I remember when I was a young boy and my dad was a soccer coach. He coached our soccer team. And I must have been around 12 years old. And we would do laps around the soccer field to warm up and to finish. And we would sometimes race each other. And because I was concerned that there might be other people faster than me, I would be looking over my shoulder. And if anyone was getting close, it would mess me up. You can't really run fast looking over your shoulder or looking back. And my dad told me, instead of looking back or looking to the side and worrying about how everyone else is running, just focus on looking straight. You may not be the fastest, but you'll certainly be faster than you are looking back. And that encouraged me as a boy to get my own focus on just my own run, being the best athlete that I could be. And it's similar with our journey with Jesus. When we are keeping our eyes on him, listening to the Holy Spirit for ourselves and not looking over our shoulder or looking around, we'll do just fine. The road won't be too bumpy. But as soon as we start listening to what other people are doing, looking at them, paying attention to them, that is the moment we'll start to be concerned and confused, deceived, and start stumbling off the path and floundering around in the darkness. So I want to encourage you as a brother in the Lord to get your focus on Jesus. No one else, not another brother, not another sister, but get your focus on the Lord Jesus. Ask him to guide you and lead you because he is the only one to, um, to be able, the only one worthy to lead us down the straight and narrow path into everlasting life.